Hello friends, in this video, let's learn to take screenshot using different methods. First we can take screenshots, then I will help you to save it as image. I use on screen keyboard here, you don't need to use it, I use it for teaching purpose. Move on to first method, press control key on your keyboard, keep pressing control key, then press print screen key on your keyboard right now i paste it here i press ctrl v to paste it let's move on to second method i move on to second tab in this browser press window key on your keyboard keep pressing window key then press print screen key on your keyboard let's paste it here Control V to paste it. Let's move on to third method. I move on to third tab. Press Alt key on your keyboard. Keep pressing Alt key. Press Print screen key on your keyboard. Let's paste it here. Press Control V to paste it. Let's move on to fourth method. I move on to fourth tab. Press print screen key on your keyboard. Let's paste it here. I press Ctrl V to paste it. Let's move on to fifth method. I move on to fifth tab. Press function key on your keyboard. Keep pressing function key. Then press print screen key on your keyboard. Let's paste it here. I press Ctrl V to paste it. We have taken 5 screenshots using 5 different methods. You can use one of these methods. Let's save it as image. Click here. Then all programs, accessories. Then click on paint. Then you have to paste it here. We have taken screenshot right now. We are gonna paste it here. You can click here to paste it or press Ctrl V on your keyboard to paste it. Now we can save it as image. Click here then save as. You can save it as PNG picture, JPEG picture. You can save it as you want. I prefer JPEG picture. Just click it. You can choose the location you want. I save it on the desktop. You can give file name. I give file name screen1. Save as type jpg ok. Right now click save to save it. The image is saved on the desktop. Here it is. Let's open it. You can see on screen keyboard in this picture. So don't use on screen keyboard. I used it just to teach you that's it. If you are using Windows 10 or Windows 11 operating system when you press Windows key and print screen key the screenshot will be saved automatically in pictures. To see that click on this PC then pictures ok. You can see a folder here screenshots you can open it. You can see it ok. Let's see another method. If you are using Windows 10 operating system or Windows 11 operating system press Windows key and shift key then key yes. Press it. You will get these options. First one rectangular snip. This one free from snip. This one window snip. This one full screen snip. You can choose the option you want. I prefer rectangular snip. I just draw it ok. That's it. Release it. Right now you can go to start. Then windows accessories. Windows accessories ok. Click here. You can see the paint option here ok. Paint. Click it open it right now you can press ctrl v to paste it go to file 
save as jpeg picture you can choose the location i choose desktop then you can name the file save it that's it image has been saved here it is if you are a mac operating system user to take screenshot of full screen press shift key command and 3 to take screenshot of full screen the screenshot will be saved on your desktop if you want to take screenshot of a particular area then press shift key on your keyboard then command and 4 the pointer will become a plus then just click and drag it to take screenshot of a particular area it will be saved on your desktop then if you want to take screenshot of a window press shift key on your keyboard command press 4 and spacebar key pressing these keys the pointer will become a camera you have to just click on the window to take the screenshot it will be saved on your desktop you can also take screenshot using the software available with the operating systems i type snipping tool yes n i p p i n g snipping tool here it is just click it you have got the tool click over here free from snip okay click this you can see the pointer it looks like scissors just draw it that what you have to do just draw it okay click on file save as desktop i have got a folder here screen double click to open file name i type one save as type we have got different types i prefer jpg file save it i close it i take it again okay i got a tool rectangular snip i click it right now you can see the pointer it looks like plus you can draw rectangle line you got the screenshot right now go to file save us same location file name i give to save right now i click on file new snip i click over here right now full screen snip i click it you got the screenshot of full screen okay go to file save us file name 3 save it okay you can use another software to take screenshot its name light shot close it okay right now go to taskbar click here it looks like a feather it's a feather okay just click it then you can select the area select the area you want to take screenshot then right click click save then go to desktop double click screen folder you can give file name then save as type png jpeg i give png then save you can also use shortcut keys you can use print screen on your keyboard or press function key keep pressing function key then press print screen key on your keyboard just press it then select the area you want to take screenshot then right click then click save you can also use shortcut keys if you don't want to take screenshot you can press escape key on your keyboard i pressed escape key okay it has been cancelled again i give print screen key right now i select the area okay then you can do some works you have got pen here you can draw it you can draw a line then you can draw a rectangle if you want okay you can draw it if you want to undo click here or press Control is it. 
that's shortcut key if you want to type text you can type it click here then click over here you can type it girl girl okay G I R L girl okay I have typed it then if you want to change the color of the pen you can change it I have changed the color I have selected blue click OK right now you have got the marker click the marker you can draw it okay okay these are the options you have got you have got many options in this software you can check it very simple thing okay I press ctrl yes to save it okay it has been saved let's see it open the screen folder I've got screenshot one okay we have already taken it then I have saved it using shortcut key okay it works well that's it these are the images that we have already saved using snipping tool okay this is the first one this is the second one this is the third one 